members of Ladies in the House to you. Actually, Ladies in the House is this lady right here to my right on guitar, Debbie Napper. And the lady to my left, another Debbie that you all know, Deborah Robinson. But we brought some friends along with us today. And the good thing about us fellowshipping with other churches is that we get to meet other musicians that's really a treat for us. And when they sound really good, like this young man up here, right. uh, we may think that we do that for We actually fellowship with First Baptist Church of Bay Shore, um, where our executive pastor, Shonda Clark, and Reverend Darius Clark is the pastor. And we met this young man, and he's so bad, he just goes by the name of Junior. So y'all give it up for Junior. On vocals, You've, a lot of you have met her before. This young lady has been grooving with us for some time, for a few years now. And we actually had a gig last night. We did a 90th uh, church anniversary for First Baptist Church of Riverhead. And we were out in Riverhead until late last night. This lady sung her heart out. So she's working with maybe 75% of a voice, or is it 85% now? <laughs> maybe 85%. But please give it up for Stephanie J. Noah. So you might want to get your microphone. And I think it's over there where she is. So how many people took the train? Y'all know me, I forgot myself. Y'all know me, right? Y'all know me as Lizette, but um, my friends in music call me Peaches. So we going to peach it to you this morning. Um, how many people took the train here this morning? Just one person? All right. God bless you. That means y'all drove, right? Well, we doing good. Y'all better make sure you pay your time tomorrow. Because <laughs> you know Pastor Kelly going to tell you, right? Everybody registered online, right? <laughs> All right. So did you take the A train? All right. Well, for those of you that didn't take the A train, we're going to go to the A train right about now, okay? <laughs> Thank you. 
matter because everything's still golden.
Sometimes you have to um, go into a place where it's just you and God. So you could not only talk, but hear him talk back to you. Because sometimes we listening and we thinking that he's not there, but sometimes you just have to really open your mind to hear him.
Because of the hands of police brutality. 